wazee wakiingia kwa kitanda ni kutuambia tusikasike hiyo masini ati usika uone kama itaamuka haiamuki No, a very good evening and welcome back to Havana Media. My name is Bonfeso Wino and as usual I'm going to be your host for today. Uh, I have got two top stories here that I want us to share or I want us to talk about. The first story is the issue of uh, fertilizers. You know, uh, today I've, I've seen something that I've never seen before. Or I was watching the Senate and this issue of fertilizers. And what surprised me was that instead of the senators carrying out their investigation very well by maybe going taking these fertilizers and uh, maybe to a factory or maybe somewhere for, uh, maybe in a lab to test whether they are uh, they are the best fertilizers or whether they are fake as they say or they are or they are okay what surprised me was that uh, the senators decided to smell <laughs> the fertilizers Uh, to make, to to know whether they 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 are good they are they are, they are fake fertilizers or not so that is one of the things that i want us to talk about another thing is uh, this issue of doctor strike Raila Odinga today i've talked about it we, we, i never I, i i also personally i never i never saw this coming on a serious note i never saw Raila Raila talking about the the doctor strike uh, not, not 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 even mentioning Raila uh, calling a conference and maybe talking about these issues like this i never i never saw this coming so raila moludinga have call, called a, a press and uh, he has talked about it and also dr nikal was being interviewed today and there is something that he said concerning the issues of doctor strike and the the issues of intern those are the top stories that i want us to talk about but before we do that i would like to give you a chance <clears throat> at the comment section so that you can tell me what you think concerning that and uh, also If it's the first time that we're meeting you like to take a moment go to the subscription area you click the subscribe button and also you like after liking you tell me where you're watching me from because as i normally say that feedback is normally the key thing in any form of communication and thank you very much for our viewers those who have been giving us your support uh thank you very much and may god bless you so much asante san now back to our stories let us start with this issue of uh, senators senators smelling smelling fertilizer instead of taking it to the lab okay uh, personally as i've told you before what i thought was that these guys will decide to take this fake fertilizer that people are claiming that is fake take it to their lab uh, to a laboratory because i know we have got good, very big lab, labs in the in the country they will have taken it to the lab test whether it is right or whether it is the best one or maybe it is the fake as people claim but what did they do instead they started smelling the the fertilizer Another issue is on the doctor's strike whereby Raila Muludinga today called a, a, a meeting. I've told you that I, I never saw this coming. I never thought that maybe Raila Muludinga would involve himself in things like this considering the fact that what is working on is much bigger than this. But instead he has called a meeting, he called he called a press and he talked about this. And uh, I want us to listen to what Raila was saying and the the way he was saying that okay the government should agree with the workers or with the doctors whether they'll be given that 207 or maybe 2000 200000 they go back to work and then after that after maybe the after maybe when july comes after the the budget has been read is when now they can come they can sit on the table and negotiate about it i've been earning 200 206000 shillings per month these are actually the doctors running level 4 and many other public hospitals There is no way an empl- employer the counties that have done so or are in the process of doing so know themselves I request them to reconsider their steps Dr Nikal uh, talked about this thing and he was he was saying that it is agree with this word whereby the the ministers or the the the, 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 the 
whereby the executive was saying that uh, we cannot we can we, we cannot negotiate with you we cannot say anything we will not negotiate or talk to you about anything until or unless you go back to work and he was saying that it means that uh, the executive is not even uh, does not even care with the life of uh, of the patients or those who are suffering in the hospital and he also threw away this word or this thing that uh, uh, this, there's an argument that has been going on whether the, the doctors or maybe the interns are working or not, and he said that the interns are working. He said that the interns are really working. Those guys really work. Is if you post and pay later, later. Mm -hmm. we can consider. What have you offered? But uh, does it mean that it has to just be one-sided? No. So okay. that we, we have had one. What have you offered? What has the government offered? Good, good question. <laughs> no, At no, least no, we have no, had no, one. I, no, we, we cannot keep on repeating the same thing. But I tell you, this is a very direct thing. Yeah? We have said, um, of the so tell us in, in July you will pay us, and we are willing to go. go. What is the government putting, not July, probably December, what is the government putting as a counter offer to them? Your students. Go back to work, people now. are dying. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. You, you see, it's not no, a laughing no, matter. No, no, no. Well, when I cried, you said it was not a crying matter. <laughs> when I'm laughing today, you are saying. No, this is not a laughing matter. <laughs> okay, so uh, I think uh, we probably are not. Uh... I mean, the, the biggest pay rise was negotiated in 2000 yeah. when I was director of medical services. Yes. When these allowances that are being removed were introduced, nobody has even asked or gone into the records and say why those allowances that were there, they were just being removed. Now, I agree. When you come to the budget, we know that you say this is the money we need to employ interns and so on. You know that we have been with you there. And we, we, we are, we, we, that one we never argue about. You also, as you say, actually put the right figures. Now, things then turned difficult, the money was not coming. Now, what was expected is go back and sit, call the, 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 the doctors and say, this is not going to happen when we want. Let's see how we are going to do it. But what then happens, the first thing you come on air and say, these people are too expensive. Yeah. Is it the, the expensive, the issue, or that the money that was promised in the budget did not come? come. The next yeah. issue you come yeah. with and yeah. say, these guys are students, Dr. Machanichero. When you came to the budget and you were asking us to give the money for the interns, were you talking of the salary they have now or the 70 that is now being brought on board? And the, what is the reason? Yesterday, the, the chair of the CRC, uh, Madam Menich, said, this is not a remuneration, it is not a salary, it is a stipend. When you say it's, it's, it's not a salary, it's a stipend, you know what we are saying, Dr. Terry, and we can't do this to our doctors. We are saying that many that interns are actually people, and you seem to insinuate it, who are being helped mm -hmm. to learn and mm -hmm. get experience before their registration. Now, I really want this to, to, to be removed from the thinking of those people in the ministry. And you are the one who can do it. You have been an intern. You know what you are doing. You know the work you are doing. Interns work. These are doctors who have graduated. They have taken uh, the Sukhris oath. They have a provisional license. There is, another, there is also another thing that I came to realize. I don't know, I don't know, but I came to realize something. When I was going through, I was, I, I've been doing some research deeply on, uh, on this issue of doctor's strike. Where did it begin? How did it start? And other, since 20, 2017. So I was, I was like, okay, this is how it started. And I came to realize that uh, there was an agreement that was made by the doctors, by, 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 the, by, by, the, by the cabinet in charge, who was in charge, uh, by the, by, and the docket of ministry. This was the agreement. Okay, this was the, this is what happened. KMPDU asked uh, Nakumicha, that is the, the CS of me of health, that he that they should work on how to post the interns. And then after posting the interns, what will happen was is this: after reading the budget, that is in July, is when now things, maybe things might change. But he came he came and and returned and turned, turned against them, and maybe she, she changed her mind. So I think that is that, that, that is uh, that is where the problem is coming from. I don't know what you think concerning that. Number one, I don't know what you think concerning this issue of uh, 
uh, senators smelling fertilizers maybe by by maybe they thought that maybe when they if they smell it uh, will they will feel whether it is the right fertilizer that farmers should use or not and also this issue of doctor strike is it was it advisable first of all was it advisable or was it good for Ella Muludinga to come publicly and uh, talk about this knowingly very well, knowing very well that it might i told you yesterday that Ella Muludinga is very silent because he knows very well that any moment he opens up his mouth talking about either Kenyan politics or what is happening it might be used against him during his posi during his, uh, his, 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 his during the, the during the election at the African Union, was it right for him to talk about it? And also this issue of uh, Doctor Nikal talking about the doctors' strike, and he was saying that doctors and the interns are really working so hard. Those guys normally work. Those guys don't play. I don't know what you think. That is just my take. I like to give you time at the comment section so that you can also tell me what you think about it. Until we meet again, I have been your host, Bonface. We know. Bye bye.